this is to do is to give you a shorthand rendition of something that you will be able to recall for the board. That's the fundamentals of this. So on the first side, on the first page, if you have the first page, let's go over this and it says emergency. So what you would come up with is a short uh, group of letters or however you think that you could remember emergency room. Let's say that the word would be ER, right? The second place would be the definition of what that ER is. And the third would be where you located. Now, the, what I was telling your classmates is that if I see a lot of the same thing on different pages, I give those pages zero. No one can have a whole group of of a hundred and some words and all of the abbreviations need, need out to be the same. This is for your benefit, not mine. So I, this is not a, a, a test. This is something that you will have to be able to go and study when you finish uh, this year. So you can have a show, you could have a little thing starting off uh, as soon as you finish and say, oh, let me go back and review this so I can do it. And by the time you get to the to the uh, state board, you will have all this in your mind and you will already have it. So don't try to learn it, you know, just for the sake of turning it in at the end of this semester. You should be doing some of it all the way through. As we go through different things, you should be trying to fill it in. But I'm not grading it on that. I'm grading it on what you give me at the end. <coughs> so that's the purpose of this. And we understand the part about me not grading if it's too much of the same, right? Mm -hmm. All right. All right. Now, there was another question today. I'm not saying that. Uh, let's go with the textbook. Maybe I didn't give you a, a good way to kind of go through this textbook. If you look at the end, I'm on chapter B, let's say. I'm moving to chapter B. But before you get to chapter B, there is something that you should be able to use to see if you know chapter A. And that is, it has a... If you will look, every chapter at the end, remember I told you it had a review? It has something called the chapter highlights. If the end of this chapter, if you can't recall what's in the highlights, you need to go back and learn what this book is saying. This is a way to recall and to study when you go get your, uh, get ready to take the board as well. But they will also have a review in the spring uh, prior to you getting ready to get out next year. And the board usually has the law part in June. So you will have a book that you can study. It has highlights that you can study before you go. So at the end of each chapter, as we go through every chapter, uh, you should be able to go back and say, well, let me go back and review and see, did I really get this right? Because if you can't answer the questions that you could give yourself from this chapter A and see what the highlights are, then you didn't get enough out of that chapter. You're going to have to go back and review it. Okay? Do you understand what I'm saying about this? Yes, sir. So this is it. The, one of the reasons I like the book is because it gives you, uh, a, you don't have to go back and regurgitate something that you already can just study a little bit more and know it. Because it does you no good to get this book, have all this knowledge, and then go to the board, and then try to stay up all night for a month <coughs> trying to learn something you could be learning a little bit at a time now. Now, now what do you know, all want to know what my question's going to be? I have no idea. I make them up as I go along. So, uh, <laughs> Let me just give you an example. Uh, what are the situations 
for child resistant clothes. Who can give permission to use child-resistant clothing? Okay. USP D1 Volume 2, United States Pharmacopeia Drug Information. What book is that, that in? Now, these are drug questions that have been out by this company called Quizlet. And this is actually, you know, you have to pay for this. This is on on your stuff. Y'all pay for those. Uh, uh, what's the what's the name of it? Y'all go. The no, no. <laughs> Google. There it is. I knew somebody knew. <laughs> <laughs> but this is right there for you to have, and it doesn't cost you a dime. Just go in, put in Texas State Board of Pharmacy uh, review questions, or either pharmacy. Uh, review question right there and these are the kind of questions that the board asks because this is based on prior courses that the prior uh, cases that the board actually gave uh, okay such as when community pharmacist dispenses fewer than 10 tablets of drug product when the hospital pharmacy fills an RX for an outpatient uh, uh, and patient and patient prescriber, who can give, you know, those are individual things that you, that they are saying that you should probably have an idea of what that means. Uh, who can give permission to you to get that one? Uh, okay. USP D1 Volume 3, United States Pharmacopeia Drug Information. References, sources included Selected laws and regulations for controlled substances contains bioequivalence information. What is bioequivalence? Well, some Facts and comparison cannot be used when listing <coughs> an ingredient on a product label as a primary source. What do you have to go back and look forward for that? Bioequivalence, right? What is it? You said bioequivalent? I said you said bioequivalent, right? Okay, what is bioequivalent? The second one was another question. The second one I just got through was another question. All right. What barbiturates are classified as Schedule Two? What is the most appropriate reference source for a manufacturer? to determine preferred, and it goes on and on and on, preferred name of an addictive additive, I'm sorry, for a product label. And if you can't answer these now, I suggest we start getting on them because these are the types of questions that the board has on the, on the test. I know you, some of y'all are chasing grades. Y'all hopefully are chasing Uh, I just have one more thing to say. Uh, I don't know why my me and the me and this this whole electronic thing isn't working. I spent a whole lot of time to get that 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 homework done, and it just came out. So what I'm going to do, if I can print that 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 homework exercise out, I'll just send it to you somewhere or somewhere, or just place it back in the blackboard or something, and put it on the paper. Uh, like I said, it was it was worth 15 points, so it was a nice little project. And it wasn't a project that I gave you just to be given to you. It was a project so that you could learn and, and be able to recall again. So I'll work on that over the weekend, and hopefully I'll have it. Because uh, I've spent hours putting that together, and I don't feel like redoing it, so I'm going to. I'm going to either have to do it or I'm going to have to try to see if my daughters can figure out how to download it from where it is without me having to. Because I, I put it all in at one time rather than do it like I normally do, do it and then copy it and do it. So we'll do that. Um, 
This is supposed to be what kind of day is this? A holiday? Yeah. Yeah. It's it's supposed to be mental health. I know, and I and I I got a mental health problem. <laughs> <laughs> I am crazy as hell. <laughs> so because of me having my my no, no. 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 we all praise no. laughter is the care to the soul. <laughs> I wish I'd drink, I'd go get me a little sip, but I don't drink. So. Um, you can always start. I can burn. No, he said you can always start. No, that's what happened. I stopped. <laughs> <laughs> he said he got the patrol in the truck. I stopped. I stopped patrol. He said he got the patrol in the truck. Oh, I have a, uh, in my house, I bet you I have as much alcohol in there as a grocery store of, of, of anybody. I have, I have alcohol everywhere, in the refrigerators, out in the garage, I have it in the room, and I have a playroom, I have alcohol everywhere, I have a small life, everywhere. So it's a party. So I'm going to come so it's a party. Well, I think it's, it's I can I have it in case somebody comes and wants to have a cocktail. So end of the year party? Huh? End of the year party? I have special stuff on the end of the year, you know, like, uh, what's the stuff that is? It's, it looks like milk, but it's something else. You put a little alcohol in it. Eggnog. Cream? Eggnog. No, it's cream. It's not, that, it's not eggnog, but it's like eggnog. Bellies. Oh. Bellies. You can buy it. Ooh, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Bellies. 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 I'm not. I don't feel well, so y'all can tell everybody I came to class. Yeah, that's okay. I'll let you know when the next mental health day comes. We have another one. You're gonna try to put it in the ground now. But but seriously, let's let's take this 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 information very, very seriously. And on uh, Wednesday, hopefully I'll have this done and you can try to turn it in by the weekend or even next Monday or something. Y'all have any questions? Hold up, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Yeah. Uh, the, the one I had uh, for take home, like I said, was 15 points. It just gives you an idea of what my questions look like. So hopefully I can have them ready for you on uh, Wednesday. Monday. Um, mm -hmm. No, no more. You have an exam. You don't have an exam. You don't have an exam on Monday. Can you do the assignment on Monday? What do you mean? Next week, Monday. Next week, Wednesday. Yeah. No, I don't mind. I'm, 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 I'm send it. Yeah, I don't mind doing that. It's going to be a lot of work, so I was going to put it for the weekend anyway. Maybe, maybe you didn't understand it. It's not an in-class item. The, the little, the little uh, project I have for you is, is to take home. And it's, uh, it's, it's not a test. It's just something that you'll have to go through and, and do things to try to learn what it means. So that's, you know, I'm not that crazy about grades, so I have to have some grades on the book because it's a mid-year, what is it called? Midterm. Midterm is coming up, so we're going to have to have some things, okay. so we're going to do that. And then you will know that as you, as you uh, see what I'm doing, you will know what I think is important and what the book thinks is important, and that's where my, my, my test questions come from. They aren't, they aren't. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. I don't do that. I don't do that. God bless you. Any other questions? Is it, is it, what time is it? It's time to go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, if my wife doesn't send us 12 more, does it? Yeah. 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 When your birthday? Because we're going to get you in the box. You did that last time. Because he said we told you the wrong time last time. That's it. But my birthday is August. I'm going to leave Okay. Uh, Y'all have a nice day. Bye. Uh, Bye. 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 B